So someone asked me if I've used cookie cutters for designs I'm not intended for, and I'm not the best at cookie flips, but I will show you some of my favorite ones that I've done. Okay, so here we have a basic cupcake shape. If you flip it upside down, it can be Santa Claus. This is one of my favorite ones I've ever done, and I love that you can't really tell that it was a cupcake. And then we have this pocket watch shape that I used to make this Christmas ornament. And in the back of this photo here, right in the middle, is a chemistry beaker that I flipped upside down to make a martini glass. And I like this because then the stem of the glass is not super thin and fragile. And this isn't really a cookie flip because you can still tell it's a heart, but you can do a lot of really fun things with heart designs. Like this back to school notebook paper right there. And you can do various inspired by character type cookies like this Moana themed one right here. And then here I made a little lingerie set that was used for my Galentine's Day cookie decorating class. And another really surprisingly versatile shape is the candy corn cutter, which I used here for candy corn and then for a jack-o'-lantern candy bucket. And then here it's a watermelon slice, or it can be pumpkin pie slices, and a pizza slice out of it. And then also in this photo is an egg shape for the turtle shell. And I also used the egg shape to make the Spider-Man cookie, which, side note, I don't do character cookies. This is my son's birthday. This is still technically an egg, but it's a little chick cracking out of an egg for Easter. And again, this is still technically an egg, but it's deviled egg cookies. And this is not an egg shape. This, this cutter is shaped like this to be this like mask and the towel and the hair. But if I did this again, I would not have ordered this and I would have just used an egg shape instead. And another one of my favorite flips that I use every year for Christmas is the gingerbread man. You flip him upside down and he can be Rudolph or he can be Randy from A Christmas Story. And this cookie just makes me incredibly happy. Okay, a few more. This one is a coffee mug, which you flip sideways to make a suitcase. I don't have a before and after for this one, but this one right next to me, the jello and stapler is actually a pilgrim hat or like a bucket hat. And the last one I have to show, which I have more, but these are the ones I could find the quickest, is this cow that I used to make a giraffe.